hey guys, as you can tell, we left off in Grout's mansion. Um, I went through on this door and I got myself killed. So we're gonna do that right now again. Uh-oh. I don't know about this, this is not good. They're waiting for me already. Oh wait, I can just kinda... keep my way through here using this barricade. Come on guys, come on over, one at a time. Can I have a gun? Um, I have uh, my crossbow's out of ammo. Here we go. I am a master marksman, as you can tell. Gosh darn it. Okay, this is stupid. We're not doing that. We're not doing that. Alright, let's crouch under this and let's get into the fight for reals. Okay. Kind of. Oh, lordy. Hey, don't die. Don't die. Stop dying. Whoa! Okay. So, yeah, that's really freaking creepy, but, um, not really intentional. Okay, a laboratory refrigerator key, and if we remember, the laboratory was back over here. Just like, little bit, little bit. Actually, wait. That, yeah, here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Cool. I picked my lock, or I picked the lock in there before, so that's kind of great, I guess. I'm really not. Okay, good. So, that's that. That means we have to do this loop down here again, which I am loath to repeat, but we'll just kind of, we'll kind of speed through it here. I like, like, there's some glitch going on. The uh, crazy people have the normal everyday police officer voice that plays... Oh, golly. Oh, golly. Hold on here. Okay. Sweet. Alright. Hold on one second here. Let me organize my inventory. Okay, let's see. I'm looking for blood, yeah. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. Cool. I just wanted to keep my blood kind of not, if not maxed out, at least high enough that I don't go into frenzy because my vampire character has the self-control of a small child. And that's generally not a great thing. Oh, yeah. Okay, buff. There's a bunch of stuff in this circle that we can go around again, but this is where we need to go, so we're going to go here. I went through all that stuff in the last video, and so I'm not super broken up about it. I have no idea what that does anymore. I am really confused. Okay, well, let's just... Just do this here. Okay, super great. Oh, what's up? Come here, come here, come here. Super into the whole fighting you unless I have to thing. Oh, I did not mean to bluff. Mm -hmm. Bluff. I meant to heal. Hey, hey. Oh lordy, close the door. All right. Um. Okay. There's the secret door that goes yep up to the viewing platform. 
which really doesn't help us any, but that's cool. Whatever, we'll go this way. Buster my sword. Um, I'm probably gonna drink some more blood here. I used all three of those because the menu doesn't close after you use one. Oh, okay. And this is the door with the thingy. Okay. Oh, and that's what that does, yeah. Yep, okay. And I'm not too worried about it. Let's see what we got here. Oh, shut up. Yep, and down here is that ghoul that died. And this guy. I really wish I could hit people when they were on the ground. That would make this a lot easier. But here's the guy that chewed off his own arm and escaped. Poor guy. Hey man, what's up? Well, he has both his arms. I, Somebody is dead and here. Um, okay, that really doesn't help me any. Come on, game. Let me through. Golly. Jammer, 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 stupid. Come on. There. Okay. Don't know why that helped, but sweet. Okay, so there's that. So I really am not quite sure where I'm supposed to go. Super exciting. Um, because I've gone through here, and I think that there isn't there something to push up here. I maybe don't know. Okay. Nah, it just seems like a short way to get back. Um, whatever. Let's go this way. Back upstairs, and then. See where else we can get into. There really isn't anywhere unless there's doors here, which there isn't. And the hand is still vibrating in a terrifying manner. Um, I don't know. There's got to be something in the basement that links to somewhere else. Maybe. Um. Maybe not. You know, who knows? Um, yeah. Yep, great. So we can use this secret door, go up here, and do what? Nothing. Um, uh, okay, so we take this to go down here. There's got to be some trick I'm missing here. Freeze, yeah, I'm not gonna freeze. You shut up. Is there, like, can I climb up here somehow? Hmm. Maybe. Oh, this is the worst. Oh my, is this really what we're supposed to be doing? I am so upset at you game programmers. Oh, am I upset. All right, whatever, come here. Great. Okay, so that was the most obtuse thing ever, but let's let's listen to what he has to say. Oops, there. The voices have increased in frequency and direction of late. They have begun to stay with me long after conversation has ceased and are serving as quite a distraction. I fear others are beginning to notice my preoccupation at the vampire gatherings. I am thinking again of the particular vampire of whom I spoke previously, who I dare not name for my good fear. If the voices are to be believed, then my caution is warranted, for they speak of his blackest crimes, both past and future. More than once, I have seen the suspicion in his eyes and heard the distrust in his voice when speaking with me. The fear must register on my face, as it is all I can do at these moments to keep from crying out in chorus with the voices. Cool. So, Grout is losing it. I am no longer safe. I know it. The voices have proven themselves authentic, and I have withdrawn from the Vampire Society entirely. Okay. We're gonna wait a second on that. Attention, but I could no longer hold my fragile composure around the ravenous eyes of my vampire peers. Especially not around him. 
The voices compelled me to make what I fear is a Faustian bargain, but I had to, for their demands are constant and merciless. I have secluded myself within the mansion. I know he will strike out at me. He will go to any length to achieve his ambitions, and he knows that I know. He knows I that I know that you know that I know. Protect my beloved wife. The cure will have to wait until our immediate safety is guaranteed. The mansion was constructed with security in mind, but at that time I was not privy to the full range of vampire capabilities. The voices echo in the twisted corridors of my psyche. Dark whisperings of a macabre and formless menace, the approach of which portends an end, an end to all of this. Great. Okay. Um, so I'm guessing that this lady in the tube here is his wife. Hi. Um, and then there's a bunch of other stuff here. <laughs> Rabbit brain. Well, hello. Play music, clock. Do you know what this reminds me of? Um, well, first of all, there's some Beauty and the Beast shit going on there. But um, a long time ago, when my mom was at art school, she said one of the st other students there would encase things in, like, plastic. And then um, you could watch them decompose. So, like, she put, like, a banana in this block of plastic. And then you could watch the banana slowly rot over the course of time because there's a little bit of air in there. And so it takes a really long time, but it's really slow. But it doesn't smell or cause any problems because it's completely encased. So maybe she smells in there is what I'm getting at, I guess. Oh, well, she is turning in that thing. Okay. Okay. Sure. Good times. Bye bye. Bye. See you later. Um, all right. Here we go. Get hype. It's time to take on the paranoid vampire lord, Alistair Grout. Or not, or he's already dead. That's distressing. Man, that's pretty rough. It looks like they staked him and chained him down and then burned him. That's... Wow, what is going on here? Okay, there's all kinds of stuff. Cigars, records, tapes. Okay. Um... I'm not Grout, you already killed him. Grout's dead, who the hell are you? Grout is dead? Pity it could not be by my hand. No matter. Soon your self made kings and false prophets and all who fear the mark of the beast will be washed from the earth oh. for the coming of the Lord. Okay. Who the hell are you? Yes, you burn. Tell them it was Grün Weltbach who sent your damned soul to that lake of fire. All agents of Satan shall return to whence they came. Let this righteous display serve as a promise to all who serve the arch fiend Lakoi. I'm coming for you, Lakoi. By the power of the Lord, I will cleanse your black soul. Alright. Cool. Um that's not good. So we've got double treachery going up and on here. So that's a psychotic vampire hunter. Um Oh, look, look at him. Poor guy. Um. Alright, let's get it out of here. I do not want to fight you while you're on fire. Oh, God, stay the fuck away. Thank you. Oh, crap. Oh, aggregated damage is so bad. Okay, stay down. Okay, we need to, like... Okay, so that... Go Whoa. Nope. Um... I forgot how to get out of here. Oh, oh shit, it's definitely not that way. Stay the fuck away. God, oh god, I'm on fire again. On fire again. 
No, going upstairs is a terrible plan. What? Okay, I guess I'm going up here. I'm about to die. I'm honestly about to die. Like, look at me. Oh, man. Okay, I'm gonna save just because I really don't. But we're gonna save in, like, a new save. Because I really don't want to, um, get screwed in case I wasn't supposed to trigger that fire. This game is notoriously glitchy. Let's hope for the best here. Let's get out. Go, 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 go. Oh, lordy. Oh, lordy. I don't want to fight you. At least I saved. But come on, really? I really just, uh, I can't believe that all the, the people that he experimented on are just like, yeah, being on fire, no big deal. No, nah, big deal. Um, what do I, I think I have shotgun ammo. Anyway, let's try some of this. Hey, hold it. Wow, guns are actually useful for something. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Come here, you vampire, vampire hunter bastard. Come on. Where are you? Please, you're on fire. Oh, this looks familiar. I think we're getting close. Or far away. Where the hell am I? And what the hell am I doing? This is not great. Oh, I can escape out a window. Oh, thank goodness. I was like, where? What am I doing? I'm dead. I went up. I did the classic horror movie thing, and in the event of a terrible thing, I um, went the wrong direction. I should really leave before the, the uh, police come. <laughs> if they do come. I don't, I don't know, but that seems bad. Oof. All right. That took a lot longer than I wanted it to. But I think we got it. I'm pretty excited that we're finally out of there. So what I'm going to do now is just save and end this episode here. And we can get on to new things. Uh, talking to the prince here. Because we're right across the street from him. So we're going to save right here. And um, I'll be back with another episode to see what happens afterward.